What is up you guys, this is all day and day one on the PS4 and I'm going to be giving you a video on why the battle mounts are important to have or why you should be getting the battle mounts. So on PS4 you can get the battle mounts when you go to, I believe, I know you can get one from the event, the current event going on right now, which would be called the Emerald Stream. You would have to get it all the way on the last one, I, obviously I've already finished it so um, I'd be getting victor medals if I got the last one, but if you get the last one all the way over here at 1500 points for your progress, then you'll be getting the battle mount, which would be the, the tree wing. And then the storm pegasus, you get the storm pegasus from when you go to capital, and then you go to hall of trophies, go all the way down, and it should be right here, battle of engineers. So when you go to Battle of Engineers, don't purchase it right away because that's like, I think it's 28,000 victor medals. Wait till it's on sale because I got mine when it was on sale for 50% off and I got it for, I think it was 50% off. I think it was 12,000 or 14,000. I don't remember exactly how much it cost, but I know for a fact that it was under 15,000 victory medals and you're going to need those victory medals. You're going to need it to be on sale. So... If you have the, if you have at least 14,000 victor medals, save it for the Storm Battle Pegasus because it's going to be super useful. So here's why you're going to want to have these battle, pe uh, battle mounts. So with both of the battle mounts on the PS4, you get up to, two, they have 210% movement speed. As you see, it says 210% movement speed. And then Storm Pegasus on the bottom, it says 210% movement speed. So not just the movement speed is what's going to help, but I mean, that obviously helps, but also being able to be in combat with them. So I guess you could technically call the, um, these, uh, wings sort of move, um, what do you call it? Battle mounts as well, because you can use them while in combat, but they're obviously not going to be as good as these ones, but the, uh, storm Pegasus and the tree wing. You can use them in combat, but they also have a like a little combat feature to them. So with the tree, young tree wing, when you use this, obviously it's not going to have the abilities like the Pegasus does. With the Pegasus, you can see on the bottom, it has um, a different abilities that you can use. When you're going to use those abilities, you need to have these crystals that you can purchase from the market. When you go to consumables, you go all the way down. No, not consumables, transport. You get an energy crystal for 50 Argents. You only need two, so you can get it up to 100%. And um, that's when you can start using the abilities for the Storm Pegasus. Just keep in mind the Storm Pegasus' damage isn't going to be like super great. But it's good to have if you're doing things like um, oh, the open adventure. So that way you can stay on your mount and kill the enemies. But... That's one feature with the battle, um, the Storm Pegasus. You can use those abilities, but also when you get off of your mount, it'll your Storm Pegasus shoots out and then hits a bunch of enemies, and then it put knocks them down. And then with the Tree Wing, the young Tree Wing, it kind of does the same thing, sort of not necessarily the same thing, but when you get off of the young Tree Wing or get out of the young Tree Wing, it's gonna root all the enemies around you. So I'm going to go ahead and, um, whoops, I'm going to go ahead and go to an open adventure. Why can I not? Oh, it's because I had it checked there. No, nope, never mind. Hmm, that's weird. Anyways, I'm going to go to a an open adventure real quick, and then I will show you what these, what these mounts normally would do for their ability types. So like I said, you can also use battle mounts in combat. So you can use them for like speed runs or if you're trying to just skip enemies and go straight to the boss, then that'll be super useful to have. So this is the young tree wing as soon as my game spawns me out. So it picks you up and puts you inside its chest. So I'm going to go ahead and go to these enemies. So when I go to these enemies, they're going to all get rooted. And then they also take damage when they're rooted. No, never mind. They just get rooted. But they get rooted for a pretty long time. So that's one. And then I'm going to go ahead and switch to the Storm Pegasus. So the reason why I like using the Storm Pegasus in the open adventures is because you can just shoot. One time. One shot. 
and you can dash I mean you can dash on the young wing as well and on your the starter pack um, the jet packs and then if you have the storm pegasus and you have energy crystals you the reason why you need energy crystals is so you can use R2 R1 and L2 R1 but I don't know what L2 R1 does because it hasn't done anything for me but when you have energy crystals you just press circle and then it'll charge up the energy two energy crystals or one energy crystal to 50 percent and then you hit circle again to charge it up another 50 percent and then um also the storm pegasus has a square button where it's kind of like a dash you can use it while you're moving and then it does that and then when you get off of your mount from the storm pegasus it'll shoot out and then knock the enemy down also doing damage But yeah, that's pretty much it with the uh, um, with the transportations. You also do have the Black Griffin. I don't have this one. You had to get this from the previous events. And I think it was like Gen 2 or Gen 3 or something. But you can get the Black Griffin. There's more Griffins later too that I've seen on PC that you can get. Um, but this is also a battle mount pretty much. I don't know if it also does damage or anything when you get off the mount but I know that for a fact that you can use it when you're in combat um, these griffins don't do anything you can't use them in combat unfortunately which kind of sucks because I mean you'd think they would but other than that I mean that's pretty much it um, so yeah <laughs> sorry I just got like a little brain fart right there but if you guys have any questions or concerns on how to get these mounts or whatever, then let me know down in the comment section. Um, I hope this video helped you out and kind of let you see how these mounts work and how you can get them. Um, and yeah, so this is all day and day one on the PS4. Have a good day, good night, and peace.